Do you play Raiden in Mortal Kombat 1? Well, here are the best cameos that you need to be using. Take it one step at a time. Subscribe here for more Mortal Kombat content and let's get into these cameos. As a longtime Raiden main, I have so many hours of Raiden and I have found the best options as a cameo for him. I'll be honest with you, as a base character, Raiden has so many tools that you don't really need a cameo for. I mean, we got projectile, we got a teleport for mobility options, we got overheads, we got lows. So what do you really want as a Raiden main? You want more damage. You want combo extension. You want to look flashy. So my first recommendation is Scorpion as a cameo for two big reasons. Combo extension is absolutely nuts with Scorpion as a cameo because you can actually call Scorpion during moves you couldn't normally combo off of like your down forward two or your down back three. You can call Scorpion in during those moves and he'll hit them, knocking them up, allowing you to continue in the air, basically continuing a combo that you normally couldn't do anyways, like so. Or like this. Scorpion makes for some awesome combo continuations that you normally couldn't do with Raiden. Plus, another set play that I love to do is using Scorpion's cameo, back cameo move, the full screen reset pullback. And the reason why you might want to do that is, of course, firstly, to charge your projectiles and zone them out just for a minute. But while you're full screen, your opponent thinks, okay, they're full screen, I gotta zone them out. And you're like, psych, teleport, biddy. So I just love playing those mind games. Like, okay, I'm gonna go full screen and be like, oh no, I'm full screen. Never mind, aim in your face. Scorpion's just so much fun to play with Raiden. And my personal favorite cameo to pair up with Raiden is Jack. First big reason is because he just offers awesome damage and combo continuation for the same reason that cameo Scorpion offered us as well. Being able to grab our opponent from specials that we normally couldn't combo off of I mean, just look at what Jax offers. With one bar and one cameo and a fatal blow, we can do 550 damage as a combo. Absolutely psychotic. Plus another set play that I like to do is call in Jax's standard cameo move, the unblockable, and then just fly over it. And the reason why that's so good is that basically makes your opponent have to jump. And in doing so, they get caught in your fly. It's basically like you're gonna get hit no matter what. I also love pairing Raiden up with Cyrax for the same reasons that Scorpion and Jax. He just offers so much combo continuation that allows for awesome damage at basically the same spots that Jax and Scorpion also offered. Allowing you to continue combos that you normally couldn't continue off of. Plus, who doesn't love the pressure with the net move from Cyrax? What I like to do is throw that out there, make them block, teleport to them, switch sides, and then continue the pressure. Or if it hits, obviously free combo. But obviously throwing Cyrax's forward cameo out there makes my opponent know something's coming and have to block, giving me the pressure that I want to have, going in for the mix-ups. But man, Cyrax also just makes for some awesome gameplay, and he pairs with Raiden so well. These are just my recommendations, guys. Let me know down below who do you pair Raiden up with as a cameo and why and make sure to subscribe here for more fighting game content and take it one step at a time.